Um, I think that the examples that you gave. Oh my are, god! Uh, yeah, last night, the that you gave, Holy shit! Examples? This is unreal. Are you guys watching this? Wait. I can't believe this right now. Why oh can't you just god. answer the question? Destiny, come on, dude. Are you not even thinking about what you're saying? I've got a bunch of viewers off, but it's probably not the hot take you want to have until at least tomorrow. What? I'm being honest. People ask me how I feel about it. I mean, like, what, what about what in particular? I mean, like, I have content to talk about. Gives me stuff to talk about. Um, I feel like I've gotten to expand on a lot of my views recently, which is okay. Um, <clears throat> I've talked to people that I haven't gotten to talk to before, which is good. Um, but yeah, I don't know. It's it's there's like a lot of like public backlash and shit, but I don't know. That kind of stuff doesn't really bother me as much. So you're just asking like, how do you feel about the last few days? I mean, like, well, yeah. I mean, there's certain content that works well on stream and doesn't. That's always something that I have to take into account, right? In terms of like how my day is gone. If I stream and I get like a thousand viewers, I'd feel pretty shit. But I mean, like, obviously it's an interesting topic and people want to get their thoughts in or whatever. Do you think Hassan's Esteban memes are a little, um, well, um, I don't know, it's whatever, dude. He brings up, like, me fucking teens or whatever, all that shit. It's just, like, it's, like, the standard, like, there's, like, um, there's, like, a, like, you go into, like, a hallway, and there's, like, a break this in case of emergency destiny, and it, like, has, like, all of, like, the standard, like, toolkit of insults you need in case, like, I say something that, like, fucks with your head, right? Like, Ben Shapiro debater, uh, child fucker, uh, tricky arguments, uh, grifter or whatever like standard shit like it's like the the box of things to use in case like destiny makes you feel bad <clears throat> other than this did you ever get as much pushback before for your beliefs um no i don't think so wait 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 are you mean like a belief in general yeah of course i got a ton of pushback on a lot of different stuff of course but for this particular one i don't think so but that's because like the people that were attacking me before were generally conservatives and my position is to the left of a conservative and they but but my position is reasonable to them like oh okay well as long as you're not trying to police my language in private whatever destiny so like it was usually pretty reasonable to them but for the left people um my position is probably to the right of them if we were to put this on like a on a single axis spectrum right so for them like they lose their mind over it. <clears throat> he's hopping on now he's waiting for you i mean i'm in my discord room he's in debate four does he not have perms on my server anymore? Did he leave and come back? <laughs> Holy shit. All right, well, dragged him in. Hello? Wow, hey, what's up, bud? What's going on? Uh, Is it is it chat sh uh, shit stirring? Sh yeah, I can't even talk. Is it chat shit stirring or is it you that you actually want to talk? Because I said I wanted to. I was down to talk about this uh, later today and they were saying that you're about to leave. Um, yeah, I got to do D&D tonight. Wait, why do you want to talk about it later today? Well, I just got started. I just wanted to go through my own shit before I went into a, like a long and comprehensive debate about private speech versus public speech and the usage of the N-word in private speech. Oh, don't worry. Um, well, actually, so I'm curious, firstly. Wait, so do you think it's okay to say it privately as long as you don't say publicly that you say it privately? Um, No, I would rather you don't say it. Like, wait, I wait, don't wait. say it. And really? Hold on. Clear. I would, rather, I would rather everyone not say it. I don't say it. Um, there are a number of different reasons for why saying the N-word and, and other uh, hateful terminology as well is problematic. Okay, wait, wait. Okay, I don't need all this. Hold on. I'm just... So you didn't answer the question at all. Let me try one more time. Do you think it's okay for people to say it privately if they don't admit it publicly? No, I still don't think it's okay. But okay, in okay. your circum... But in your instance, I'm saying like I would... If you're not going to stop saying the N-word, I would rather you just at least yeah, not Yeah, I'm not asking. I don't know why you're telling me what like a rather. We're not talking about like, would you rather this or that? I'm just asking this one very simple question. Okay. So if you think it's okay, or I'm sorry, if you don't think it's ever okay. Wait, why don't you think that that's significant when it's like almost the entirety of this conversation? Is I, what, that, no, because it's, like, I've it's, already conceded that I've literally already conceded that I, I, I can't stop you from saying whatever fucking thing you want to say. We're talking about whether or not you can stop me. This okay. is a very simple question of whether or not you think it's okay to say it privately if you don't admit it publicly. And it sounds like your answer to that is no. Is that fair? Whether Why it's is okay it so to hard to just private... answer this question? Is it because okay? You always... Because, Destiny, um, you ask for... When I debate you, it's not just debating you. It's debating your brain trust, and it's also debating and, and watching fucking clips and a subreddit full of sycophants who turn around and then gaslight and change the narrative and consistently fucking clip you mean like when you gaslit me last night do. saying that i you didn't come on and say oh. i was belittling blacks when you that was clearly the first thing you said we even watched yeah, a clip of you really saying interesting it interesting that you say that because uh I, I didn't say like you're belittling black people in private as your first implication was which is what confused me and then we followed through on that conversation where you went back you saw 
the clip itself. I didn't even see it because I didn't even click on it because it was a waste of time. And then you followed through by changing your narrative. It's in my subreddit as well. Like they clipped it out. I wouldn't have even noticed it if uh, that wasn't the case. Uh, there might have been a misunderstanding. I'm trying to be as charitable as possible. Um, and if there was a misunderstanding on your end, then that's okay. Okay. Um, I'll but go back say, and review like, that. I, but... I, okay. Do you want to know what the biggest damage is of having these sorts of discussions, especially sure. like the one that we had last night? Mm hmm um, you and I have, I guess, different moral systems. I really can't describe mine. I'm, I'm not philosophically uh, well-equipped enough. Um, maybe I could, but I'm not going to engage in that right now. Uh, and, and for me, having that conversation where you're uh, triggering people and you're being triggered yourself, uh, especially two random black people that most people are unfamiliar with who don't understand the Twitch space at all, is always going to have negative consequences negative consequences such as um them looking angry and okay, emotional okay. can we before we go feeling like they're belittled this, okay we're pivoting down do you understand right now that you're pivoting really far away from, from the original question okay this is like i don't know what brain trust or whatever we're talking about just the original okay um, the, no no no, 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 no i don't care yeah, i understand okay just very 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 simple questions okay okay so the initial question was is it okay to say it privately as long as you don't admit to it publicly. Now, it sounds like you've said no. That's all I'm trying to get. Can oh, do you okay. really feel like you yeah. can't answer that question? Um, No, I, I think it's it's not okay to say it privately. It, it certainly isn't okay to say it privately either, especially because of uh, what happens when you do say it privately. You open yourself up, especially as a public figure, you open yourself up to a, a, a whole bunch of different scrutiny where people will feel a different kind of way about you when it inevitably gets exposed that you do say it in private. So let's say that you say it privately, but it's never exposed. Is it okay then? If you say it privately but and it never, never gets exposed, exposed uh, I guess. Okay. So it is okay to say it privately or... Dude, come on, Destiny. Yes, in a hypothetical scenario in which literally you are screaming it in the fucking International Space Station and there's not a single camera there and there's no one else there and you're just screaming the N-word at inanimate, ab inanimate abjects, objects, sure. Like, it's a, it's acceptable. Like, what wait, are wait, you wait. Can I ask you a question? What are you, you trying wait, to no, no. Uh, draw I, from? Sir, I already I, said that contextual... What am I trying to draw is I'm trying to figure out what the fuck you believe. And it's impossible because you can't answer a single question. You just want to talk in stories all day long. I can't, like, I don't. I still don't know what the fuck you think. I, I have no okay. idea. Because okay. right now well, you just you said... Want to, do you, you want me to go back? No, 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 no. I don't want you to talk a million miles an hour because you're just going on to other I'm random not. things. Okay. I'll, I will talk as slowly no, no. as I can. It's not about talking slowly. It's about pivoting to points where you feel stronger because you realize you're full of shit on this answer. I'm not trying to... Dude, okay. I can't even fucking debate to save my life. You really think I'm like uh, I, masterful I'm enough to I'm not trying to debate. I'm just trying to figure out what the fuck you believe. Seems like That's you're all right. A little bit. And I can't believe you were saying that like I was fucking Britney venting you. That's kind of lame. But whatever. I mean, you did. You hopped on to the end of a show uh -huh. where I'm getting dogpiled so that you can throw on some dumb fuck at homs after you yeah. were already roasting yeah, me. Yeah, that's, 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 what, that's, that's what I was trying to do and not trying to fucking, you know. Wait how, wait, how do we pivot this bit. again? Wait, hold on. We're not pivoting. I'm sorry. So okay, my, let's, my let's original question. Do you want to hear my position? Do you want to hear my position? Not that it, it matters to you at all, I don't think. No, I, I, think I don't want you to talk for, for 10 hours. I just want okay, you I'll to. I'll talk for a minute. No. I'm going to try okay. to make this. Here's my question. Is it okay to say it privately? Can I, can, I just, can I just tell you my point before you ask me, before you start asking questions? <sighs> okay. I'm just going to re-ask this question at the end, just so you know, but go okay, for it. It's okay. Fine, it's yeah. fine. It's totally fine. Okay. I think in most instances, Saying the N-word, both in private and definitely in public, is bad. Okay? Now, having said that, it could be contextually appropriate to use the N-word in a private setting. Definitely more so than it could be contextually appropriate to say the N-word in a public setting. But having said that, as a public figure, right, you acknowledge that you have certain responsibilities, or not even certain responsibilities, but you believe that within your moral framework, that you don't want to say the N-word in public because other people could weaponize that and use that or actually racist people could feel emboldened that it is okay to say. This is because of the power of the word itself and the history associated with it and the damage associated with the utilization of the N-word, which degrades and dehumanizes black people. Now, I'm simply stating that if you are not going to Stop saying the N-word in private. As a public figure who has made 
determination that you shouldn't say the n-word in public you should not admit that you say the n-word in private all the time i think this is something that you agree to as well i'm done that's it okay i'm gonna ask again because you didn't answer the question is it okay to say it privately if you don't admit to it publicly and then why or why not can you not answer this okay question it privately i yeah. said in certain contexts it could what be do you okay mean by certain contexts not like you're reading it out of a dictionary but in the context like, of an offensive for, okay. joke all right i wasn't gonna do this but like um i didn't really read the uh, logs that got leaked or whatever but i have seen you say the n-word on the internet before in the context that you use the n-word when you're calling someone an r-worded uh little f-worded n-word mm -hmm. that is not an that okay, is not so an appropriate we've so okay that so context makes you yeah. look like a terrible person that's great so one you just pivoted to a, a position that i don't defend anymore so i said really Wait, um, but you asked me what no 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 you no 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 no, no, I, no no i yeah i asked you what I'm context and then context. you wait, no no i asked you what context and then you pointed to a, a specific example so you're not answering the question so no, first that, that no, can i just finish I just no really gave that's context you that's didn't you didn't ask, okay so what it would be acceptable um, I think that the examples that you gave. Oh my first, God! Uh, you yeah, can't last answer a night, question. The you gave, Holy shit! This is unreal. Are you guys watching this? Wait. I can't believe this right now. Why can't you just cry? answer the question? Did you just call to cry because I'm literally answering your? No, question you're not answering. I'm yeah, asking. No, you're you saying, did. well, in the context I provide, but I'm asking you, in what context is it acceptable? How can you not oh, answer no. the question? I am. I said the three examples that you gave last night, while cringy, are still relatively acceptable contexts. I'm not. Okay, when I ask you for a, a, an argument for why it's okay or not okay to do something, I'm not asking for Whoa. examples. What I'm asking for is what is the formula that you use to determine those examples are good, okay? So for instance, if I say, what's your example of a good person? And you go, uh, or, or no, I'm sorry. If I say, what makes somebody a good person? And you go, oh, I think that Z is a good person. I'm like, well, no, 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 no. Well, what like makes them a good person? Like, oh, well, I think like A, B, and C are good people. I'm like, no, 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 no. Like, what makes someone a good person? Like, well, I think that D, F, and E are good. No, I'm asking you, what makes it acceptable? Don't give me examples. Don't give me context. Just tell me, this is what would make an edgy joke acceptable. Like, what is the formula that you use? Um, what is the formula that I use that I think that an edgy joke is acceptable? Yes. I think, um... I think like a retelling of a specific joke is acceptable. Whereas if you're using the N-word exclusively in and of itself, if you're using the N-word exclusively in and of itself to dehumanize and degrade black people or the existence that like black people are N-words, uh, when you're using that against another person, it is in unacceptable fashion. Okay. So if you're I can't quoting... We're still having, I can't believe we're still having this conversation. I know. I can't believe how hard it is for you to answer a question. So if I quote <laughs> to a friend something no, from I meant like... I'm like having a conversation with a 30-year-old man who's still trying to defend the usage of the N-word, even though when pushed back on it, you say, oh, well, it was actually just defending edgy jokes. If that's your position, we can actually have a conversation that's around That's always that. been my position. And I told so you this last why don't we time. have that conversation Because then? you don't want to. Because you constantly want to reframe it to this because you no, get slam dunks with your no. audience full of dipshits. Yes! That's no. absolutely... I even... Do, hold on, hold on. Yes, do you want to bet $1,000 on this right now? We can go back last oh night. No, 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 no. I'm asking you. We can go back last night and I specifically said, hey, this is about edgy jokes. You're the one that reframes it specifically about the N-word. Do you want to Do you want to go back and look for that? We can find those clips. Actually, we don't even have to bet money on it. We could go back if and look for those specific clips. Changed, if your position has changed from saying, I say the end, I literally said this last night as well, and I will repeat it. If your position has changed from, I say the N word all the time in private, and that's fine, or whatever Dude, the exact. You're such a uh, piece of say, shit. Holy no, fuck. No, I'm not. I'm you not are. You're not taking bad. one quote you're, when I've written extensively about this. I've made like fucking pages of fucking posts like related to this topic, you and you're going for the one quote that I use when I was no, like responding dude, to somebody else no, trying to like no, fucking no, flame me. That is what you're using clarify, right now. I'm asking you to clarify. I'm not. I'm not trying to, dude. It is literally not a gotcha moment. It is. Okay. It's the I'm, ultimate bad faith bullshit, dude. Oh no, dude. You're. You are. Okay. Can you just like. Okay, just reset all of the fucking previous biases you have and try to look at this in a charitable fashion. I'm trying to- Why the to fuck would I do that when none of you have ever even uh, like applied an, ins of, uh, an inch, uh, an ounce of charity to anything I've said? Girl a subhuman. How many times, that, even in that instance, I say, I defended you. So shut the fuck up, okay? D well then, oh, dude, okay, yeah, maybe because it was convenient for you there. I defended you on the internet. Shut the fuck up. Dude, are you see, you take shots at me constantly. Dude, before I talk to my podcast co-host today, you're talking, I'm like, oh, well, if he ever says it in private, that's like dehumanizing as fuck. Don't sit here and act like you fucking stand for me super fucking hard, okay? We are nice to each other sometimes on yeah, Twitter, no, no, but no, you no, no, take no, no, shots no. at me constantly yeah, on your stream. Every positions. time you do it, every time you do it, I get a fucking clip positions. of it. Don't pretend okay, okay, like you're not, going out of not, your way to fucking help dude. me or some shit, okay? 
<laughs> he has to tell his stream now, like, actually, I help Destiny all the time. It's crazy. Are you yeah. going to calm down? I, I, I'm, I'm super calm. Okay. You don't seem like it, buddy, but it's okay. Um, We're going to get there. Listen. Okay. So, Wait, can we just talk about the subject rather than this yeah, derail? I, I mean, I want to. I, okay, I so really you said do. retelling of a specific joke is acceptable. So if me or another white person retells some joke that has the N-word in it, is that acceptable? Wait, uh, I'm sorry. I wasn't listening. Can you say that again? You said <laughs> that in specific contexts, it's okay to say like a racial joke. And then you said, and I quote, retelling of a specific joke is acceptable. So if I retell a joke from like the Chappelle show or the Chris Rock show, and it has the N-word in it as a white person in a private setting, is that okay? I guess it, it depends on the context. It depends on additional context. What like other context? Who's saying it? Are they a racist person? Things that you also, you and I both agree on, but uh, that are important, right? Like you agree on this, right? Like you, yeah. you said that you would have to check beforehand before you yeah. make a, a so statement about like a racist statement around some other people, or you try to be as polite as possible and don't say it around specific people that you yeah. know will take offense to it. So you like agree on my position? Or try hex. Listen, I agree all the way up to this point. Oh, but then then we're you, done. Then I'm, we agree on everything. As soon you, as you, but as soon as you say, I know, but as soon as you say, I say the N word. It's one thing that's taken oh, okay. out of context. That's a, yeah, yeah, that's no, a no, separate. No, that's a separate one argument, though. We're not talking about that right it, now. No, Destiny, you're misunderstanding the point. Okay? No, I'm not. You're if misunderstanding. You say, this, we can have this argument. I'll talk about it's this. Literally undoing all of the okay. things that you have done. I disagree, but that's a separate argument. Point. Listen, let, okay. So but, I just know, that's want. Been my argument since day one. No, right? it's not. You just earlier told Trihex that if I say it, I have the clip of you saying that just because I say that privately, it's like dehumanizing the black people. So you don't agree yes, with that. The N word in and of itself. In the way that I have seen you use it, that has been leaked, and that I've known to, to see. And now the, you're the, going back to it. like the specific no, one-off instead of the formula. That is, because that's not, no, 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 it's not a formula. That is literally why people are upset. Okay? No, it's not. Okay, I'm curious you, then. If Wait. You literally, if the only instances of you using the N-word in public were exclusively when you were like reading a Tom Sawyer quote, I don't think people would be this upset, why okay? But you are known to have used it in the past. In that way, you have changed since then. But when people still, when you still turn around and say, I don't only say it in public, but I'm saying it in private all the time, it still sets a precedent that, like, you're probably fucking dropping N words and weaponizing it against fucking other people all the time. Maybe not towards a black person, but it's still, the word itself still implies that, like, you can use that against another person uh, and, and call them, like, subhuman, like a black person who is subhuman. Okay, are you done? Because I'm dumping yeah. everything you just said. It was all a waste of time. So let's go back to this one thing again. So you're telling me that it is okay in some context in a private setting for a white person to say the N-word. Can you just say that? Because that's what you said earlier. Because if you believe that, it's we don't okay. disagree yes. on anything. Yes? Okay, it is. Yes, it is. Okay, uh, but again, thank you. Oh, no, 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 not again. No, 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 no. Don't run away from that, okay? No, I'm that's not. It. I okay. yes, then, but, my opinion on this, by, but my opinion on this is still largely insignificant in comparison to the overwhelming amount of people of color that are going to have a different type of that's uh, fine. opinion on it. That's okay, okay, though. You agree with yes. my main point. You think that yes, there are times... Listen. This is not a gateway to, like, but, Destiny, what you have to realize, like, this is being utilized as a fucking gateway to say the N-word all the time. I disagree, but that's a separate conversation. How? How? We, that's a Do separate... That's a separate you conversation. No, no, that's a separate. I don't want to have that conversation. We can have it in like two minutes. That's the conversation minutes. I want to have. Yeah, I don't then we'll have, have it. That well, conversation. I do care about this because you just earlier told Trihex that it was intrinsically dehumanizing for me to ever say the N-word privately. But now you seem like you're changing your mind on that. Or you never believed it's, that. Or you were just saying it's a shit server between me and Trihex. It's, wait, why do you think that like I'm the one who's responsible? Why don't you think that Trihex personally ha uh, feels some fucking type of way about you using the N-word? Like, is it- Hold on, so those aren't mutually exclusive. He can feel a certain type of way and you can still reinforce that feeling by saying destiny is dehumanizing you. Those believe, aren't mutually exclusive. I, I can't believe that you think like, I, I didn't even want to fucking have this conversation with Trihex after you guys had this conversation at Raj. I like literally was like, hey, I hope you're all right. Like, I hope you're doing wow. fine. Wow, did he friend. what? Did he hold a gun to your head and like force you to have it? Or what do you mean? Like, how did you get bullied into having that conversation that you definitely didn't want to have? Why do you think everything is so transactional, homie? It's Sometimes not about. Wait, why are you backpedaling to trend? Wait, are you trying to just, just dig out like NPC just, insults against me? You just said you didn't want to have no, the conversation. Why I'm did you have it friends. then? Because he's my friend. And so he, then you he, did want to have that conversation. Emotional distress. Sure. So then you were willing to have that conversation. Don't sit here and try to think. Oh, I didn't want to talk about it. You clearly, if he would brought no, it up, I you were willing even, to talk about it. Oh my god, dude, you are fucking awful, dude. Holy shit. Okay, listen. I had the conversation because he wanted to have that conversation, and he wanted to have it on stream okay but that that is like we have removed far far away from the original point that we were supposed to have well the original because point is you think it's okay for because white people to say the n-word like privately it. because the implication is that like i'm fucking what is it i'm secretly like going up the tracks and be like hey you should get really mad at destiny 
because he uh, because he said he says the n word in private and then um and then has consistently defended it as though that was the position that he originally had even though apparently that's not the position that he originally had he actually has a more nuanced take on it and he thinks that it's okay to like laugh at edgy jokes or make edgy jokes every now and then my position is edgy jokes are fine i make them in public i make them in private as well as long as you know you're i, I personally don't like the n-word um but you think I, it's, it's okay in certain contexts privately you could, yes. Okay, that's um, a, that's cool. Could. Okay, we agree with that. So we no, can move on to the next topic. Gamer, bro, like Tom Sawyer argument. We, like, no, I'm not at all. We can move to the next topic, though. Like you agree with that. That's fine. We can move to the next topic, okay? That's whether or not admitting <laughs> to it publicly, it, it makes it all of a sudden undoes everything. Also, just so you know, your community is not going to be okay with you admitting that, okay? I don't know if you think that oh, that's thanks, what everybody... Dude. I don't know if you think that's what everybody thinks that the argument because is maybe, about. Because maybe you and I have a different understanding of like what contextually is appropriate and what isn't contextually appropriate appropriate okay sure That's maybe we do is. but you but are literally both of us are... agree that white people quoting funny jokes that have the n-word in them maybe done by Chappelle or Chris Rock or something still, that, that could be funny privately cringy, but I can't I, I think that, we're not asking about if it's cringy or not I don't use it personally don't I care if you use it personally That's not the conversation topic you're pivoting so I'm much you, you like not, you don't you can't you I'm telling you do you do you find I, it troubling that you can't just own a position like, just own it. Say something and own it. Stop running away from it like a fucking coward. I think it's I'm cringy. So I would never so do it. Blah, blah, blah. Don't do that. Just own it. And bold. You're such a fucking brave and bold. There you bold go. Go to the dude, NPC man. talking points. Oh, white guy want to say the N-word. <laughs> dude, oh, yeah. I mean, I'm good, right, guys? I'm cool, right, guys? Dude, no, own a position. Have, have a fucking Destiny, spine. Just own it. Destiny, you love you love mm -hmm. calling people like uh, crypto tankies and shit. Yep. But you are literally the Ben Shapiro for gamer words. Right I'm not now. crypto like, anything. I am more transparent. It actually is. I am more transparent with anything than any of you spineless fucks are on this platform, okay? That's why when I say something, that's why I say it, and that's it. I don't have to qualify. Like, well, I say it, but like, I, I would never say that, or I think it's cringy, or I don't think, you know, I don't think it's funny, blah, blah, blah. Like, I, I say it and I own it, okay? You well, should I take a note from Bernie Sanders. He did it with the taxing the middle class. You're, you're the Elizabeth Warren here, and I'm the Bernie Sanders in this conversation, okay? Just fucking own it. You're don't run Bernie from Sanders it. Just own it. Yep, I'm, that's I'm right. The Bernie Sanders of saying the N-word. Amen, brother. That's exactly okay. where I'm at right now, okay? Just now, own your position. Instead of, instead of crying about or trying to figure out what my audience is going to say, mm -hmm. I've already told you what my personal position is. Okay. I don't personally say it because I think it's offensive. Cool. I don't personally quote the N-word. That's fine. But no one asked what you what you personally did, though. I don't know why you're bringing it up. It, but if someone else is doing it in the mm -hmm. privacy of their own conversation with another person, there are specific contexts in which you could probably say the N-word. Cool. That is That's my, point. my position, is, literally. Holy I know, shit. But, but I know. Now, here's I, the I big problem. Wait, the position. here's the big problem. You just said that I'm undoing everything by admitting that, but you just admitted it. What do you mean? You just admitted to no, having a private I, public language differentiation. You said that I undid everything by admitting that. You just admitted it. In private is still bad, though. It's literally. Wait, okay, wait. So now you're changing your position. <laughs> no, because it's the fucking context. Are you are you insane? <laughs> like, how do you not understand that it's contextually appropriate in certain circumstances and contextually inappropriate? How, how, like, how is this impossible to understand? You were, if you didn't understand this distinction, you wouldn't be trying extra hard to fucking act like it's just edgy jokes when you get called the fuck out. All right, out listen, I love you, buddy, okay? That was all I needed for today, thanks. That, it's, we're done. It's over. I mean, what do you want me to say, dude? Holy shit. I, I don't know why people can't just own. This is like, this drives me so crazy. Just own a position, okay? Like, if you want to talk about fucking child porn or fucking incest or the N-word or one, some bullshit, then fucking I'll own it. I'll own any position. And I'll get attacked for it all the time, too. But don't sit here and be like, oh, well, I think it's okay, but I would never do it. And I don't think it's blah, blah, blah. Like, just own it. Own it and say it. But the problem is, by him owning it there, well, now look. Now we're in the same boat. So hold on. <clears throat> Hold on, guys. One second. Let me get my uh, let me get my uh, impassioned speech ready. <clears throat> um, <clears throat> don't ever tell me, okay? Don't let Hassan pretend to you that he's progressive, okay? Because he might be progressive in all of his outward-facing points of view, but when he gets on, and, and he gets on, and there are black people watching, and he sits there and says he can say the N-word in some context in private, he undoes all of that. Even if he has a private point. When he comes on publicly and he says all of that, he just undid everything that he's ever done, okay? There you go. All right, we did it. <sighs> Uh. Wait, can somebody link me? Why'd you leave though? Cause he, cause he, because he won't hold any argument, right? Do you see that like as soon as I push him on that, like, oh, okay, he can't answer a question, right? Because the problem is like Hassan might have some personal principles. I don't know, maybe he does, 
but he's he's so fucking afraid of his community turning against him. He's so fucking scared that other people will criticize him. He has to qualify every single fucking thing he says, like, well, no, I wouldn't do this or that or that. But essentially, he literally just came and gave me my position. Like, he literally just verbatim repeated my position on private language. I don't, he might have even bit it from me. He might have even stole it from my arguments. Like, I, you know, if I was with a friend and they were saying things like, you know what, I'm going to be honest, I would never hire black people. Those N-words are all lazy as fuck. I wouldn't think that's okay either. Like, no, God. that's not, and it's not even just because of the N-word. You're just being racist, dog. No, that wouldn't be okay. I agree with Hassan on that. There are ways that you could be funny with edgy humor, and there are other ways where, like, if some guy's, like, just making jokes about, like, submissive Asians or some shit all day long, you'd be like, dude, like, it's kind of fucking weird. Like, what the fuck, man? Like, this is literally the reason why I, like, ended, like, the way that I say certain words, because I heard people using terminology in private, and I'm like, I'm really uncomfortable with this. I'm not gonna say this publicly anymore. I thought Hassan said- I'm sorry, got him real good. You're totally not mad, my dude. You convinced me that saying the N-word is always okay because there's no such thing as nuance or context. That's exactly what I said. Good job, Beholden. Um, the arcane failure. I thought Hassan said it wasn't fine to just say the N-word without the context of a joke, right? And you jumped on him on that, in my opinion, illegitimately and booted him before I could explain. No, he literally said, he literally just gave verbatim my explanation for using the, like, Hi, using edgy I'm humor feels privately. Good man. Are you going to give us on props for being honest with this? No, because as soon as I pulled him in at the end and I said, well, listen, you just made the same error that you said that I did. Um, holy shit, that is a 12 out of 10 meme. Um, now that you've just committed the same error I did, now he wants to walk back and like rectify like all of the things he said. Good one, guys. He's molding so hard. He should be molding. He just got he just got exposed on national Twitch TV. Okay, for the whole world to see how does it feel. Ugh. The silence after you said yeah. Okay, listen. <sighs> fuck. I hate to leave, but like I have to go get food. This was supposed to be Melina time. She's gonna be Pug. super fucking mad at me. Hi, Melina. I love you. Not everyone is capable of figuring out how exactly to weave their beliefs to be consistent. I don't think Asana is being malicious. Okay, but the problem is that it doesn't matter what your intent is when you're actively harming another person, right? His Sanbro is donating. Here's money just for sticking to what Thanks. you say. The problem is that, um... The, the problem is that, like, if he doesn't have it, like, totally figured out, he probably doesn't have a right to come on a show and try to roast me. Oh, and I even wrote down another thing that I wanted to ask him. His, he frames everything so disingenuously. I, I, writ, I wrote this down. It was a quote. You're having a conversation that is triggering to random black people who don't understand the Twitch space at all. I was the one that got ambushed with that topic. I'm the one that got ambushed with that. I didn't want to, I didn't even know that was going to be there. Those two black guys specifically agreed coming onto the show beforehand that they were going to nail me on the topic. How is it that I'm the one that gets in trouble for it? Like. <laughs> Hassan is calling to a bitch right now. <laughs> oh, shit, dude. Fuck. Oh, and I didn't get to ask Hassan? Why does Hassan defend Comtown publicly when Comtown uses slurs? Literally, here's a tweet a year ago. Maybe he doesn't anymore. Maybe now he disavows Comtown. But then he says, hey, Comtown is like, a, oh, what is a podcast you listen to but don't recommend to people that often because it's weird? And he says, Comtown. Like, go back in? I don't know if he's going to want to talk. He called Irrelevant a bootlicker? Ew, really? Yikes. Because that black guy didn't agree with him. Oof. It's like, it feels like sometimes it's a, oh, no, nah, I feel like I'm making Candace own arguments. It's really uncomfortable. I need to get out of this space. This political space is fucking cancer, dude. I'm going to fucking become a goddamn conservative by the end of this. Candace Owens and me are going to be fucking hooking up by the time I'm done with this shit. Jesus Christ. It's like, they're like trying to collect like their own blacks to like use as like pawns in their fight against like, I don't know. It's like fucking weird as fuck. Like imagine calling another, I don't know, whatever. Ugh. I'm going to click the irrelevant comment. He's molding so hard saying he'll never bring you up again and saying this is bad for his. Pokemon said she'll moderate health. between you and Hassan. Unsubbed from him and subbed to you for sticking to your original point. Thank oh, I mean, if she wants to. I don't know if she said that. I think she would message me if she said that, though. But <laughs> if she wants to, sure. I, but I don't think so. I don't think she said that. I don't think that would be good for Pokey's brand to be involved in, like, this kind of conversation. I don't think it would be good for that. Why didn't you know it was a topic but everyone else knew, including the irrelevant kid? I Can I... Hold on. I actually try to do research for shows. Oh, God. 
I try to do research for shows that I go on. This was the topic list that I was given. And I'm not trying to shit on Mindwave because I don't care. But this was the topic list that I was given, okay? Canadian elections, Democratic primary, Trump's response to the Syria-Turkey situation, Mark Zuckerberg's secretive meetings with conservatives, SCOTUS, California bans. Here's the roster. This was the topic list that I was given. <laughs> and then after the Canadian elections, what does it mean for the Canadians? Topic two. The N-word. Oh, I was not ready for that. He said he's never talking to you again. <laughs> Oh, man. Listening to you on a sound debate feels like it's the Twitch primaries or we're going to have to elect one of you boomers to Twitch president. Yeah. Hassan is claiming you're a grifter. Yeah, he's mad because he just got shown the fuck up. I, and, and I don't mean to say that like in a, like in a, in a fucking like show off so, way, but like he said some real fucking dumb shit. He came at me really fucking hard calling me a fucking racist and then he shows up and he has no fucking idea what he's talking about. Just like fucking Alabrell, just like fucking Bad Bunny, just like fucking Mike from CCP, just like fucking Peter Coffin, like every, uh, I, okay, okay, I'm done. Can we be done with this? I kind of, this feels like a, feels like I'm jerking myself off too hard here. Like I'm going to fucking break a ball sack or something. Um, a total bait, total fucking nihilistic, like, I don't really give a shit, disregard for everyone that he talks about, and all of his, like, sentiments about social justice seem insanely fake after this conversation. Because I don't sit there and back up a guy that's publicly saying, can somebody link me the Hassan clip? Wait, hold on, hold on. Can somebody link me the Hassan clip about how, like, I undid everything? Wait, does anybody have that? I should, like, archive these. <clears throat> his viewers are turning on him for justifying the use of the <laughs> Hasan oh, I'm reading his chat. Hasanabi, you can just say N-word instead, though. Unless in this context, the person saying it is also black. Oh, and I told him, too. I told him that... <laughs> I told him that his community is not going to be happy with that position. That's the same point Steven has. Most people just, you know, tell other people just to watch said comedian instead of retelling the joke. Don't know if this came up before, but if you say in public that you say it in private, then... Just kidding, ye need lose. Oh. I'm not talking to him again. You guys can call me a pussy all you want. There's literally no reason for me to... Wait, no, no, link the one where he says I've undone everything. Where is it? I, give me... My, uh, it's give me that one. That's the one I need. I'm literally I'm undoing everything. Oh, it's this. Like, like, so, like, this is the person who's like, oh, I don't know why you don't want to have a real confirmation conversation with me. Right? Literally Call undoing me every okay, work, any work that Steven, he's okay? ever done. I'm sorry for being aggressive earlier, really, right? So, okay. going I, it fucking doesn't forward, surprise me that you would say that, like, a going study forward, would show if he fucking that ever tries to claim, like, oh, I'm progressive, like, like look at how much I've done for the left, on, fuck off, uh, certain dude. types of negative opinions. No, there's no, there's no um, It's not that his base is gone. He's literally rewiring the fucking gamers that he's pulled away from the all right. Back to fucking shitting on black people. And, like, if you want to, making it seem like it's okay to fucking say the N word and debating this conversation. Now tell me what you think his position was here, making he, making them think it's okay to say the N-word. Do you think he was okay with me saying it in private, or do you think he just floats between whatever position he feels like is playing best to the audience at that time? Because notice when he was in here, or here, I'm curious actually, um, somebody, can somebody link the Trihex clip earlier? I, I don't want to do this too much because honestly it's boring, but like... The N-word or the hard R, in, in the context of like using it as a pejorative, not like you're reading fucking an old book or something. Now, here he's making you say, well, it's okay if you read it in an old book. Thing, right, you're not, you're not, not quoting like you're history. Like, not like you're quoting a historical document, but mm. you're saying you are an N-word with a hard R, haha, -ha, or like, stop being an N-word with a hard R, haha. -ha. Like, when you say that to someone in private, do you think they're racist or not? That's the question. Notice how, like, he always avoids, like, the comedy thing, which is specifically what we're talking about. We're talking about, like, um, we're talking about, like, edgy jokes. Notice how he, like, dances around it so much, though. Does it sound here like he thinks it's okay to make edgy jokes when he says the only context that's appropriate is quoting historical documents? Doesn't sound like it there, right? Sure as fuck doesn't sound like it here. Gamers that he's pulled away from the all right. When I say the fucking shitting on black people, and like, if you want to, making it seem like it's okay to fucking say the n word and debating this conversation. So when I say having the conversation with black people and triggering them to make them look like they're fucking out of touch and insane. So what? So what is that? So this is why I'm sorry. I freaked out a little bit in the beginning. I did because it was really frustrating. But like you guys were like, um, like this is why I was so frustrated. Like answer the question. I didn't. I don't. I still actually don't know what his position is. I don't even know if he has a real position on this. It might just be something he doesn't really care that much about. It doesn't seem like it because it seems like every single time he talks about it, he utters some different thing. Right? It's like whatever plays best to his audience at any particular point in time. Um, 
He actually accused you of calling people the hard and R word um, in private, and you haven't responded. I have responded. I don't do that. That's not funny. That's not a joke. If I just like message him, was like, oh, I think that X black person is an N word. No, that's not funny. That's not humor. That's just being fucking racist. I don't do shit like that. Like, oh yeah, Lily is a C word. Or like, no, of course not. What the fuck? But that's never what I've defended, right? I've always talked about like edgy humor, and the examples I've generally given are like quoting TV shows. Like, that's it. The worst part about today is Hassan sub will brigade the shit out of artists. Listen, there's only 10,000 Hassan subs, okay? Um, <laughs> eventually, we'll ban them all. Ever talk okay. to Destiny or about Destiny going forward after this? Oh. I'm not talking to him again. You guys can call me a pussy all you want. There's literally no reason for me to ever talk to Destiny or about Destiny going forward. What are your on getting more views talking about the N-word than the Democratic? Elections, Pepe laugh. Feels good. After this. Like, a person who fucking treats me in the most disrespectful pa fashion, who treats me in my time with such disrespect, when he is an insignificant motherfucker himself. Nope. Fuck the content. You guys can go watch him fucking cry about it all he wants. Alright, okay. T-minus how many hours until Hassan mentions me again? Either Wowie. makes, like, a sly joke, or how long? This is Squirrel Person 2.0. How long until Hassan is making jokes with the serfs or some other friend, or doing some shit where he's, like, referencing me? Like... Minutes? I think it'll be hours. I think it'll either happen tonight or tomorrow. How many times do these people say like, I'm not, I'm not saying anything just anymore. Ugh. Why is no one talking about how he ran away after getting one thing? Um, because they think it's a victory because it's their it's team sports. Oh no. <laughs> he went, old clips now? Yeah, whatever, it doesn't matter. He went like a minute. <laughs> Never mind. Um, okay. Why would you even think for a second that you would have the wherewithal to have any idea what the relationship